Good morning, fans of Bazaar. Today I am bringing you evidence of the devastating tragedy of young people who have fallen victim to the horrors of a website. The website that is Tumblr. Yes, it seems that it possesses their brains and turns them into mush. Yes, mush. You heard me right. Here in my report I am going to expose the dangerous world of the Tumblr teens. Tumblr. See their reactions as I use these trigger words against them. Number one, Nutella. <laughs> Number two, Benedict Cumberbatch. <laughs> I know, it's shocking. Number three, Peanut Butter. Peanut Butter, give it to me now. Why, give me to the peanut butter. Number four, Yoga. <laughs> yes. And finally, the outside world. <laughs> this is Tamar and Lizzie, two victims of this tragic disease. Now girls, what would you do if Tumblr was taken away from you for a day? Can they do that? No. They can't, they, do can't that. Do, they can't do that. Okay. It's, it, it's, really right. it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Okay, okay. I need you coherent, Tamar. 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 It's okay. You still have your Tumblr. That's. That's okay. We're not talking about cats right now, girls. Cats are the best. As you can see, it is nigh impossible to have a co coherent conversation with these victims. Tragically, as of yet, there is no proven cure for this disease. So, the victims of Tumbleritis must spend their lives locked in front of a cute computer screen with their eyes glued to it, and they will never experience the outside world. Yeah.